Welcome everybody to a little demo. This is kind of super cute. It's called Eaten Eaten. It's about it's a tower defense bug game. So kind of think like maybe like Plants vs Zombies, but not Kawaii. And it's like a tower defense. It can it seems it, there's only four levels. The Steam link is in the description below if you want to try out the demo. It is very adorable. There's only four levels again, so we have- I have played it a little- I have played all four levels just to get the hang of it. So we start off with a little plant. It eats nutrients. This is our nutrients or our money. It'll eat nutrients to start grow. And once it grows... Oh, yeah, there we go! It, it's so freaking cute! It's an apple. So we'll get an apple. This is the creature spawn. So these are little caterpillars that... So the caterpillars will eat the apples in order to grow, and then they turn into butterflies. And then this is the third one. It is a spider that will eat the butterflies and the caterpillars in order to survive. As soon as they become adults, they can... they can reproduce. So that'll keep your economy going too, so you need the... And you do need to feed your bugs too so we need to keep popping out fruits in order to feed the butterflies and the caterpillars we need to pop be popping these out in order to feed the spiders and the birds are not in the demo yet unfortunately so we don't exactly know what they do but every time we kill an organism it will spawn a new plant and then it will continue to grow so it wants us to create six on the first level which we will absolutely do and it spawns two each, so that'll be super helpful. So we can just kill all three of these, and then we'll get six. This should be six, right? Yay! And then the enemies will come. And then they will fight off the enemy. Yeah, I die. Oh. And then he spawned a plant, and he's gonna eat the nutrients. Come on, little booties. Come on, little apples. Defeat those things. Let's spawn some real battlers. Defeat, defeat. Okay, so we need to spawn five caterpillars now. So we got two. So those are little caterpillars. They'll go around eating the fruits. Oh, we need to spawn more. There we go. Oh, I probably did too many. So three will be fine. This game, at, le at level four, it's it starts to get pretty intense, not gonna lie. But it is so cute. I just fell head over heels when I seen it was apples. Like, that's so adorable. That was a little eyes. All right, we defeated that one. Victory. And then this is the food chain. This is going to teach us all about what eats what. They do need to eat to survive, so that will go ahead and eat that. And then he's going to be starving, unfortunately. Poor thing. Yeah, and the, these are at the bottom of the food chain, so we need to spawn those. Uh, yeah, they mature and they decompose eventually. So they will die on their own if they don't get eaten. Yeah, they just eat fruit, and then they die. And also, our, whenever they die, or you kill them off, they will give us some nutrients, too. So let's create some fruit to feed our caterpillars. So fruit, 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 fruit. Go around! Go, little bitty! Go eat! Go eat! Is that a little violent? Because, I mean, they're whole living... I don't think so. And observe the chrysalid, and then they'll turn into a butterfly. Look at the little butterfly. This is so cute. They become adults, and adults are way stronger and can breed. Now we got to create three of them. There is a there is a pause button. It is space, and there is a uh, speed up button as well. I don't know. I don't know what. Keybind that is for. 
Doesn't seem like it speeds up that much, honestly. Yeah, whenever you, oh, also whenever you do spawn a caterpillar, it does spawn a fruit with it, so you're still getting a fruit even, you're just not getting two at a time. There you go. If you don't want to spawn them into butterflies, you can kill off the butterflies, and this is the egg that that one just planted, so that will go ahead and spawn the caterpillar. If you're not wanting those around, you can absolutely kill them off, and they will give you nutrients as well, because we need nutrients to survive. It's just a cycle of life. Yep, so now we're out of nutrients. This is going to teach us... Yeah, so we can click on any one of them and they will die and plant. The higher level they are, the more nutrients they give us. So that, see, the butterfly gave us four. The fruits gave us one. The mushroom gave us a lot there. Yeah, so living corpses, nutrients, and then it's just the cycle. So we gotta maintain our nutrients in the best way we can, as well as maintaining our economy over here to hopefully def defend off the uh, predators. So let's maintain three butterflies. Oh, there's a little diglet right there that we can get too. Yep, we need more. Oh, he was gonna eat them. Oh, Quinius, there you go, there you go. Go eat, go eat, my friend. Go eat, Diglett. Why aren't you guys attacking? Come on. There you go. I'm gonna turn into a little butterfly. As you go, it does get really intense, so super crazy. Piglet! Kills them, my little booties! Kills them! Woo. Yeah, they can't grow if they don't have nutrients, obviously. So. They'll de look like they de decompose like that. You can also destroy the yeah the stems. Okay, so now it's just let's just we need more nutrients like real bad. Oh, I probably didn't. I didn't mean to let you uh, go into a caterpillar. You can destroy the eggs too. They give you a little bit of nutrients to survive. We can uh, destroy the everyone's eating the apples though, so and then that enemy, the corpses of defeated enemies add nutrients to our cause. Oh, come on, I clicked on that multiple times and it won't give it to me. Dirty, dirty trick. I kind of really don't need any more caterpillars right now. Okay. I guess we'll take a caterpillar. That's fine. But we are running out of nutrients like crazy. You're about to decompose anyway. There we go. And I'm not sure. It says that the enemies give us nutrients too, but it doesn't seem like it. Like, it showed us that, that the first time, and I don't know if it gave us any nutrients as we're killing the enemies. I think we're only getting it from the plants that we destroy. We'll just let that one grow. I'm not sure if that's a bug, but it only does it once in that tutorial scene, and then no more after that. That's unfortunate. We'll go normal. Normal itself is 
there. Okay, and then this is the second consumer. So we're gonna spawn some, um... Oh, and then we learned about ultimate. So this is the ultimate ability, so we'll right-click... Select it, and then... Okay, I guess it was just the bug right there that happened. So, anyway, back... So we'll select the ultimate ability. I mean, this is still a demo. It's not out yet, so there's gonna be bugs. Uh... Okay, bugs. And that's their ultimate ability. You can also right click. Uh, you can also right click them to do it. Uh, yeah. You can only do it once until you get kill enemies that drop this. I mean, I feel like that's fine. One butterfly is not too bad right now. And we'll have another one here soon. Oh, bees, yes, so bee swarms. Th they'll randomly come out, and then you can take them and place them anywhere. They have... They, I mean, they attack. But other than that, you can't really do anything with them. They don't get eaten. They're more of, like, little blockers. Okay, we need... We need y'all to eat some more. Nope, I don't need no- I don't need no one hatching right now. Destroy the... Apples here, we'll destroy some plants so we can get some more nutrients going. My goodness, we got a ton of apples. Why do we have so many apples? There it goes. There's an ultimate ability we got. If we equipped bowls, now we're going to be able to get the spider. And spiders are my... are the most scariest things ever. And spiders will eat the butterflies and the caterpillars. So it's good to have enough of them around. Oh my goodness. That is quite a lot of caterpillars there. Am I going to get spiders? There we go. Yes. Can't do anything now. Secondary consumers, they only eat caterpillars and butterflies, yes. Gosh darn it, I didn't mean to have so many! No, don't eat that. I need that. Thank you. Oh well, that's fine. I think it'll be fine if I kill off some of these butterflies, though. I mean, we have a ton of fruit around for the butterflies to eat anyway. And, oh, maybe I have more. Ooh, I have way more spiders than I do butterfly. Ooh, that's a problem. We need caterpillars. And we need a lot of caterpillars. So their special ability is they just create, like, walls of spider webs. I need, I need more caterpillars than butterflies around here. I need some butter. I can't believe it's not butter. Okay, yeah, we need a lot more. Because our spiders are going to be starving soon. And that's going to be unfortunate for them. Okay, good. I think we got a good source of caterpillars going. We need some, uh... Here, we will do... Oh, we should have done you up here. I didn't even realize. Okay. Oh, well. It'll be fine. Our spider got this. This is spider babies. And they will eventually hatch. Bye bye Uh, yeah. They're good for blocking, but they lack attack power. Which is good to keep on. Oh, man, I didn't mean to do that. Probably get some more caterpillars going here. The final assault! Can we survive the final assault? Oh, man. I have way too many spiders and not enough caterpillars and butterflies. Oh, goodness. That's a little bit unfortunate. Because... My spiders are eating them all. No, I didn't mean to. 
I didn't mean for you to do that. Okay, we'll just use your special. Good, we got some bees going. Okay, we'll just let you hatch. Because I kind of need you. Oh, I don't, I didn't need you. Gosh, I didn't even notice you. There we go. Summo. Okay, we'll just... It's the final wave. Everybody do the wave. It's the final countdown. Okay, that was kind of a waste right there. Gosh, come on. Come on, you guys. You got this, you got this. And we got another one, and... Come on, you guys, they're destroying your babies. There we go. That's what I was waiting on. And good thing you went up in a good spot, too, so... To be able to use your ultimate ability. Anyways, that's Eat and Eaten. It's such a cute little game. I adore it. There's obviously some bugs to be had. And no pun intended with the bugs. But I think it's adorable. The ecosystem is pretty cool. I just like how you have to manage one in order to manage another one and then they breathe and so then you have to manage all of that and it's just, it gets super crazy. I can imagine that this is going to be like complete chaos in the later levels, but uh, so far there's only four levels in the demo. I'm pretty impressed. Plants vs. Zombies. I love tower defense games, so... You have to manage an economy, economy of bugs and stuff, and then the birds aren't in the demo yet, but they will be eventually, and I don't know what they're planning on doing. I don't know if they're going to plan on adding more bugs or more creatures or something as you go up the eco chain, uh, ecosystem or some whatever that is, but... Anyways guys, if you have liked this video, again the description will have a link to the demo that you can try it out yourself if you like it. Uh, don't forget to like and subscribe, it really does help out the channel a lot. I hope you have a great rest of your day, and as always, I will see you in the next video. Bye for now!